Hello everyone, and welcome to another edition of The Video Ends When I Reach Round 10. Today we're closing out the end of the wholly original maps on Black Ops 3 with Garad Krovi, because after this we have the always elegant revelations, and after that we have to get our toes wet with that of the Chronicles pack. Uh, yeah, you know, it'll be interesting doing Chronicles eventually, because, you know, they're, it's all familiar, to say the least, you know, it's all stuff we've seen before, I've played before, and if you're a World at War map, I've played you twice already, so, just a lot to unpack. But for now, we've got to keep our eyes focused on the present, and what we have currently at the present is Garak Rovi. Uh, I'm getting a little tired today. I was hoping I would just kind of crank out all of BO3, to be honest with you guys, but uh, being kind of winded... On Garad Krovi, you know, before we even unpack everything that Chronicles has to present, it's not a great sign. That's okay, it just means I'll have to do some more tomorrow. And that's perfectly fine, I don't, you know... I don't know if I've said this before, but my goal is, is I want to have all these done by BO6. And so that, like, when I do BO6, it's like, oh my god, guys, look, I just traveled through all of zombies and we're here at the new release isn't that awesome like that's the goal that's the dream that's the vision per se be interesting to play bl6 because like what if i'm like able to uh Play, get round 10, and then immediately submit it. That would be hilarious, right? Oh, he's such a sleepy little dragon. He's so tired. He's so tired, guys. He's so tired. Ah, almost did the classic. So I collected the loose change, but I did not buy the perk, did I? That is so... That is so eyesore of me, isn't it? That looks important. This is another map I don't know a whole lot about. I'm being honest, I might know about it the least. This might be my least known map of the BF3 ones. Which is crazy to say! Because it's Grod freaking Crovia, you know? It's definitely really cool. Oh, sweet. Double points. Is inevitably required for a secure future. You choose a battle you will not win. Get your points up. Get your points up. Get your points and get them up. Points up. Ow. Really? What? Oh, it's for the trap. I'm like, what does that have to do with this? That's crazy. I was thinking, like, my brain started, like, flashing Alpha Omega at me, and I got scared. I feel a little dumb now. That's cute. Oh, okay. Events long foretold will soon come to pass. But I fear then that leads to, okay. That's neat. Some burden has been lifted. I will find a new path. Rick taught us. Uh, eh, we'll hold on. We'll hold out. One who showed me just how blind I have been. I 
It's a cute little thing. I guess it's where a dragon's egg would be. It's a cute little thing from Tokyo, you know, talking about, uh, like, the progression of the story. And I really hope that that is something that continues to happen in Black Ops 6. Because, as you may know, with the operators, that wasn't a thing that really happened in Black Ops 6. In Black Ops 6, it, it was very... Raptor 1. You know, like, just Weaver or some... Strauss, was it, talking? Like, it was very irrelevant, it felt like. It didn't feel important. It didn't feel like we were connecting to those people as much. So, I hope that's something that can be quite rectified with the whole returning crew thing, you know? Select, you know, map crew or whatever you want to call it. Do I need to turn on the power first? Stopping on fire. Okay. I was just heading the wrong way. Just heading the wrong way again, okay. A lot of branching paths involving turning the power on first, huh? I guess that's kind of cute, right? It's like... Um, these are all things that you're seeing, and you're like, Oh, I can't deal with that yet, and you gotta turn on the power. Which is the power just up here? This is where uh, the little eyeball is, right? The answer's that. I... Dragon command code cylinder fired. Wonder if that has to do with pack a punch? Does she, you know, ride the dragon? I don't know. Just throwing it out there. Okay. Bowie knife, that's tempting. Jug! Kill kick. Why? I mean, I might as well get it, right? Disappointing. I almost, I mean, totally. Console is disabled. I should have kept the shotgun. Dead shot? No. Good pal. Thanks, but no thanks. Electric Cherry? Hell yeah. I didn't even know that was on this map. No, I would assume that Jug would be in the place called Infirmary, right? Salvation is dead. 
cute. Sage is on this map? The heck? I see what people are talking about this map, bro. Well, if this is the infirmary, it has stamina. I think my logic has been debunked. Oh, so this is just like a different. Yeah, because that just. All right, so that's just me going a different way, I suppose. All right, dragon. Thank you. Up here now, right? Go down here. You shine a light right here. Looks like something that'd be like a secret passageway. Ugh. Sir, you do not have Jug. This is fun. I like this. this is nice. Welcome back, PPSH. Oh, this takes me back to... Okay. So right, bro. Dude spitting. All right, so you can clear the debris. That's cute. What's up here then? Box. That's just like the other side. Forgot I had mule kick. I thought I got rid of one of my guns. It's round nine, so I really shouldn't need to be worried. But mm -hmm. just curious. I wanna know so when I actually do this map. There's speed. Just chilling right there. We go 10 rounds without the dog round equivalent? That's cool. I don't think I want that. For funsies. I'm feeling special. How do I take that? Oh, uh, there's something with the map there. <laughs> Since I was walking in this little electric area, I was like, uh oh. All right, yeah, that's it. You're it right there, isn't it? Yep. 
Bingo. Fun. I had fun. This is kind of like the most clueless I've been, admittedly. That's okay. Flinger trap. Oh, can I get on that? Is that going to kill me? Not enough. Eh. Eh. There you go. Hooray. That's a... I know the... If you reach a certain round by a certain time, you get, like, bonuses and stuff. I think that's cool. I think that's actually really fun. I think it rewards speedrunning, and I think that's super dope. When I uh, did the round 10 with my good friend Cannon Red, I saw that, and I was like, oh, cool. We actually reached it, too. That was neat. 